We, you know, they're, pl they're playing hide and seek. It's very sort of frustrating in, in terms of uh, we have family men here, fathers who have abandoned their work, their day-to-day uh, -day issues, not because they don't have their own problems, but because they believe this is priority. They're willing to sacrifice their working time, uh, their normal course of events to stand against this. This is a Monday morning, look at it. These are all working men. And they said, no, this is more important. And so, of course, every time they do this to us, they, they cause a, a, a tremendous amount of irritation uh, in the society. But when they ask us, when are you, get, when are you gonna get tired? We say, never. Uh, we're, not, we're, not, we're relentless. We're saying, you, you announced it today, we've gathered here today. You said that you've canceled it, it doesn't matter. Uh, we'll stand here till the end of the day. You do it tomorrow, you do it in fall, you do it in winter, always. And this so-called window of overtone is working the other way around in Georgia. They think they're making the society used to this. The result is the opposite. People are getting more and more frustrated by the sheer fact that in this poor, disintegrated, and uh, tarnished country, uh, certain groups, globalist groups in the West, see no other priorities but to fund perverts, what we perceive as, as perverts. So we're saying do not try to uh, uh, make us into a mob, but do not uh, attack our values. Do not be so condescending, so offensive. Stay away, we have our own way. Uh, and our history of tolerance, our history of uh, ability to tolerate everything uh, goes way beyond the current 30-year-old experiment, which is exterminating the demography in the societies which have both. Last but not least importantly, when Soviet Union broke apart, we were 6 million. Now we are 3 million. And it is largely due to unlimited uh, imposition of uh, abortion policies on Georgia, uh, gambling, narcotics, everything that is associated with aggressive forms of Western liberalism. We're saying enough, we're being exterminated. This is an attempt to put a last uh, nail in our demographic coffin. We're gonna pop it out, we're gonna pop out all the other nails, and we're gonna revert to what? To not medieval ages, not sort of regressive, retrograde, anti-progressive society. We're not that. Uh, we're going to revert to our beautiful tradition, which tolerates everyone as long as there is a sense of good and bad and shame uh, and is able to live with everyone. But we will not give up our identity. And sometimes these sponsors of uh, uh, Western sort of NGOs do not understand what they are dealing with. We've had a much harder 20th century. When fascism came upon us and said, we're gonna dominate you, we sacrificed 400,000 men. Georgia was number two after white Russia, after Belarus, in terms of the percentage of people who died in the war. When communists came before and after that, they said, we're gonna make you Marxist. We said, come dance with us. Uh, we're gonna be around, you're gonna perish. Same thing with liberals. And they're saying we're gonna make you impose certain parades like communists try to do, uh, and we're gonna uh, corrupt your politicians and make them adopt laws which are gonna make you uh, uh, subordinate to this. We're saying come dance with us. We're gonna still be here uh, after you're long gone. We want to, we love uh, Western cultures, we love British, we love American people. Western Europeans, we respect them. Uh, we are compassionate about the imposition of this upon their lives. It's been happening for so long. People, sometimes I, I, I get the sense that people don't even understand what's good and bad anymore. Over there, we have tremendous respect, but stay away. Georgian identity, ancient culture, Christian values are here eternally. No chance for them to do this to us. What happens if they turn up somewhere else in the city and they try and... We go there and we disassemble um, this parade. We, we, we are saying we are... Many people are calling for violence, people are calling for beating, 
we are here for a different purpose. We are here a, a group of motivated men who will go in and drag them out of there for their own safety and do everything we can uh, to, uh, to avoid violence but also avoid holding this parade. If police tries to prevent us, we will go through it uh, with our bare hands and take them out of there. It doesn't matter if they are uh, foreign, Georgian, whoever they are, whoever comes to uh, disrespect our traditions is attacking us, is attacking our way, and they will not be allowed to do it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.